Hey everybody, it's me, Ula for Junkie, and uh, about to shoot my Sniper parody, the movie Sniper by, uh, by Stephen Skull. I'm about to shoot it, shoot the movie parody, upload it. Hope you guys do enjoy, but make sure you do share it, because it will take a lot of work. I'm, I don't know how I'm going to do it all, but we'll see how the end project is. But also, um, that's why I'm wearing the cat backwards and stuff. You might not get what's going on, but trust me, just you can probably find off the internet to download or whatever, or you can go to the red box and rent it and watch it. But uh, yeah, Stopper by Steven Seagal, or he's in that, and I'm Steven Seagal. Piddle's gonna be some random dude shot in the back. Then we're going. To, I'm gonna be Rob Van Dam. And I'm gonna set some props out and stuff. It's gonna be really cool. I mean, sure, it's gonna be a little. I mean, I'm more man production, so you know, it's not gonna be like, whoa, so many people on the screen, or whatever. But I uh, hope you do, you guys do enjoy. I'm gonna go shoot it, and uh, I'll see you at the outro. Bye. Am I alive? Sadly, yes, you are alive then, for the rest of this sucky movie. Now you may be wondering, what is this guy's name? We never really specify that. Me, Steven Skull. I never really say much of him. Maybe once or twice I say his name. So we're gonna call you, guy that got shot in the back. And uh, you may be wondering why I wear the shades all the time, even indoors, because I'm just so cool. And I'm going to let you know. I'm going to let you know. You have to be cool to wear sunglasses. Did they leave? Is the evac team going to come back and, and get us out of here? Yes, they did leave, but they had the primary objective. And uh, don't worry, they're coming back. And when they come back, they're going to give you a cupcake out of honor. As you can see, they've been giving me a little too many cupcakes myself. So, but don't worry. You're going to be a hero that has a cupcake at the end of this. Hey, I'm really thirsty. Do we have any water? Man, I ran out of water, but don't worry. I'm sure there's two our two guys that would never say their name is down there and I'm pretty sure they have a bottle of water. I'll go get it. I think there's any terrorist out here. Good thing. Cause if I was and miss him. Oh. Alright. Now I just gotta go get that bottle of water that's over there. Wait, hold up. I think somebody's coming. I'm a friend with terrorists. Yes, I am. Look we'll at these two dead bodies. Come on, Xano. I'm not going to lose them at all. I'm just leaving crap this. Good thing that terrorist was a dumb terrorist, and he didn't lose anything off his body, like ammos or water or supplies or guns. So uh, I'm gonna get this ball of water here and head up for some more show. There's more show. I had to put him down. My water now. So I'm your water, people. I got a shot. All right, I'm back. I got you a bottle of water. Thank you for the water. I really needed it. Is help coming soon? Don't worry. Help is on the way. I forgot I, I found this radio outside on the dead people. On the people that got shot, shot as well. I called. I called and Rob Van Dam picked up and he said he's on his way. So Evac's coming in no time. Well, Van Dam, I hear your distress call. I'm coming back. We got to target the base. I'm on my way right now. And Steven, I'm just gonna let you know. On the way, I kinda, I kinda picked up the, the terrorist leader's dog. So you know, that, that might be bad. I'm gonna be putting bombs because I'm just suggest predict, predicting attack. Because I'll just predict that they know where we are. So I'll see you later. I, he'll never know. I mean. His dog was just so cute. I couldn't, I couldn't resist to take it. 
I had to take the dog. I'm sorry, Steven. I'm sorry. I got plenty of bonds for the terrorist attack that's going to happen. The terrorist attack. First bomb done. Rod. Van. Damn. Alright, on to the next. Alright. What to the one the second bomb? Rod. Van. Damn. Alright, on to the third one. Alright, on to the third bomb bomb. On to the terrorist meetup group. Ah, I see you made it, Rod Van Dam. I see you're not a coward after all. So, where's my doggy? I don't have your doggy. She was just too cute. I could not take her back to such scum like you. You didn't bring my dog, eh? Well, you messed up. Because when we get done with you, you're going to be in a graveyard. No, I think you're going to be the one in the graveyard because I got bombs planted. And here's the detonator. Crap, why are they not working? The bombs, they're not working. No. Don't worry, Ron Van Dam. Steven's girl's got you covered. Uh, I'm going to shoot the bombs. Crap, I missed. Hold on, Steven. Okay, don't worry, Wob. I still got you. I can still save you. Oh, man, I missed. I'm out of bullets. Rob, no! No! What you say? Mm, that you only meant well. Well, of course you did. Mm, what you say? Mm, that it's all for the You guys think you're above the law? Well, you ain't above mine. Hey guys, Steven Seagal here. What an awesome film, wasn't it? If you did enjoy it, please like and subscribe. And uh, I'm just going to let you know, guys, I put in a lot of time on this um, and a lot of effort. And I uh, hope you guys did enjoy it. And uh, the one thing, I, um, one thing I request from you guys, if you did enjoy it, please share it on Facebook, Twitter. Share it with your friends at school. Well, your friends anyway. It's about school time. So share it with your friends at school as well. Ch tell them to check it out. Because, I mean, really, I did put in a lot of time in this. So I would appreciate it if you guys would do that for for the for the video and for the channel. But anyway, if you, did get, if you guys did like this type of um, video, if you like movie parodies, please tell in the comments description below that you uh, enjoyed it and that you... Uh, want more because if you want more I'll make more uh, I really did have a fun time shooting it uh, I might have a blooper reel on the way as well after this but uh and also Piddle Piddle wasn't cheap on the on the on the script okay and Nani Siobhan the other dog the little miniature Yorkie Piddle requested a whole pizza so I had to have him I had him have I've had to order him a whole pizza for him to eat okay so he wasn't cheap so, you know, he wants an Oscar too, so, you know, maybe, maybe he will get one. It's only if we share it, share it enough, guys, but, uh, and Nani, she, she wanted some belly, belly rubs, so I had to pet her. 
I mean, it was it was tragic to be honest. I mean, it was it was a lot out of my pocket. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please uh, like and subscribe and make sure to share because I put in a lot of time again. I did put in a lot of time on it, so I would love to see this video like spark up. It I would just that would just melt me. I would just be melted if I saw this video like blow up in views and stuff. But uh hope you guys enjoyed. This is Life for Junkie. See you guys. I mean, this is Steven Skull. See you guys in the next video.